Hi, welcome to 7 Facts. This is the channel that holds the largest collection of facts about every country, state or territory in the world. Before we begin, I ask you to click the subscribe button. I upload 3 times a week, every week, so there's plenty of content. Mayotte is a region of France, located just north of Madagascar. France gained control over Mayotte in 1841, control they managed to keep to this day. But not without controversy. Mayotte chose to remain a French dependency rather than join the other Comoran islands in declaring independence in 1975. Geographically, they are part of the Comoros archipelago, but politically, not so much. Comoros laid claim to Mayotte shortly after their independence and continue to do so to this day. However, the people of Mayotte voted several times in favor of remaining a part of France rather than joining Comoros. The island thus remains under France's control and quite recently, in 2011, they became an overseas department, thus becoming an integral part of France and the EU. One more reason why Comoros doesn't like the current status quo is that their capital lies in Mayotte. Well, sort of. Zaudzi was the capital of Mayotte until it was replaced by another city. But earlier, it was also the capital of all the colonial Comoros. Today, Zaudzi is still a major city in the region and Comoros does have another capital at Moroni. But this just goes to show that the history of this place is still kind of inseparable. Mamudzu is the capital city of Mayotte and its largest city with a population of about 71,000 people. They have been chosen as the capital in 1977, replacing the old capital, Zaudzi. In fact, the city was developed in the 1860s to second Zaudzi, but in about a hundred years, it managed to take over as the major urban center. Today, Mamudzu is the political, administrative, commercial and tourist center of Mayotte, so this is where you go to get things done around here. If you visit Mayotte, there's plenty of beautiful things to see here. But if you're the diving type of tourist, you're in for a treat. Mayotte is surrounded by tropical coral reefs that obviously hosts an almost unbelievable amount of life. Careful though, the barrier reef encloses one of the world's largest and deepest lagoons, so getting lost or diving too deep can be a problem. Additionally, the fringing reefs are interrupted by many mangroves, which can also put you in peril. Despite its constitutional evolution from the status of an overseas collectivity to that of an overseas department, effectively becoming a constituent territory within the French Republic, with regards to the European Union, Mayotte remained an overseas territory in association with the Union and not a constituent territory of the EU. However, following a directive of the European Council, Mayotte became an outermost region of the European Union in 2014. Mayotte, however, still has a long way to go before it becomes an integral part of France and the EU. This will require abandoning some customary laws, adopting the standard French civil code and reforming the judiciary, educational, social and fiscal systems and will take place over a period of about 20 years. Despite becoming an integral part of the EU, the region remains by a significant margin the poorest in France. Mayotte is nevertheless much more prosperous than the other countries of the Mozambique Channel, making it a major destination for illegal immigration. But still, poverty levels remain high, and their GDP per capita is still at around 30% that of metropolitan France. One peculiarity of this small island nation is the prevalence of supernatural events specifically possessions by jinns or spirits. 
While this is not in any way unique to Mayotte, it is still more common than in other places of the world. Roughly a quarter of the adult population admits to have, at least once in their lifetime, entered or witnessed a state of trance, in which they believe they were possessed by certain jinns, who then maintain stable and coherent identities from one possession to the next. Jinns are, according to Islamic and pre-Islamic sources, spirits or demons, so no, you definitely don't want to be possessed by them. These were 7 facts about Mayotte. If you enjoy the video, please leave a like and subscribe. Share your thoughts downstairs in the comment section and afterwards check me out on Facebook and Twitter. A good way to offer more support to this channel is through Patreon, link in the description. I hope to see you next time, bye.